Hi guys, welcome back to Ivy's Kitchen. Today I am doing a Mother's Day special with my mom, Linda. So today what are we making? We're making a fresh lumpia with a fresh um, or a fried dropper, garnish with sweet sauce and crushed pepper. Peanuts. Oh, peanuts. I always <laughs> say that pepper. It's peanuts. okay. Peanuts. So what we have is a fresh lumpia wrapper that we're going to stuff with um, a mixture of vegetables and pork and shrimp. Uh, topped off with her sweet sauce and garnishing it with some peanuts and probably garlic. So if you're interested in seeing how I do this, keep on watching. Actually, how we do this, right? <laughs> keep on watching. For the complete recipe, please check out ivyskitchen.net. Now I'm going to show you how to make the batter. It's pretty simple. We're going to add some eggs. And we are going to whisk this with the milk. Just like so. I'm going to now add the oil because we want to mix the wet first before we put in the dry. And our flour. And we want to flavor this with salt. Again, if you want the recipe, please check out www.ivyskitchen.net. And please follow me on Instagram at Ivy's Food and Facebook.com Ivy's Food. I will put the information down in the description below. So it's pretty much like making a crepe. And that's how simple it is to make my batter. Lightly spray the surface of the pan with a non-stick cooking spray. Add the batter and twirl the pan around just so the batter covers the pan. You're going to cook this for about 40 seconds. When the edges of the batter begin to pull from the sides and you see small bubbles forming in the middle, you can gently flip the lumpia wrapper with a spatula and cook it for another 10 seconds or until it is firm and dry. Remove the lumpia wrapper and repeat with the remaining batter. Okay, my mom's gonna teach us how to make the sauce. She's adding the water. What else are you gonna add next? You have to bring it to boil. So we have to bring the water to a boil. Go it's ahead. boiling, Ivy. Pass me the brown sugar. Okay. Here you go. You want me to pour it in? Yes, go ahead. Trying to dissolve the sugar in the hot boiling water. Should we help? Oh, yes, that means garlic. Pass me. Okay. Yes. Garlic okay. goes in. Perfect. So what is this sauce supposed to taste like? Yes. We'll make we'll make it sweet sauce. Okay, sweet sauce. Soy sauce. Soy sauce. Now is that low sodium soy sauce? Low sodium, soy okay, low sodium. This is the cornstarch uh, slurry. So it's about uh, two tablespoons cornstarch to four tablespoons water. Mm -hmm. And this is the thickening agent. I'm just gonna go ahead and pour that in. You have to stir while pouring it. Okay. That's it. That's it? That's it. Let's taste it. Dip our spoons. There you go. Mmm. Perfect. Mmm. <laughs> That's Perfect. really good. For the filling, we are going to add water to the pan and cook the pork until the pork is cooked through and most of the water has dissolved. Once the pork is cooked, set it to the side, add oil to the pan, and saute the onion and garlic until fragrant. Once fragrant, add the shrimp and the vegetables that will take longer to cook, which are the green beans, the sweet potatoes, and the carrots. 
When the vegetables are halfway done to your liking, add the jicama. Once the jicama is cooked to your liking, add the cabbage and the bean sprouts. You're going to cook this for another 5 minutes or so. Once it is cooked to your liking, add the tofu and just cook for another few minutes. We are then going to season our mixture with fish sauce and the chicken bouillon cube. Okay, so how do we okay. fill this up? This is the lumpia wrapper, put in a plate. Put in a plate. The lumpia wrapper. Put the lettuce in the middle top portion. Okay. Put what kind of lettuce? Wrapper. What kind of lettuce? Ro romaine. Is this? Romaine lettuce. Yes. Okay. A spoonful, around two spoonful of filling. Okay. Over the lettuce li leaves. Okay. So it's two of this. Yeah. Make it two or three, depend how big the size of your wrapper. And what do you think? More? One more. So make it three. So three spoonfuls. spoonfuls yes. And then now in closing it, you have to start in the lower portion or lower part of the wrapper okay and then roll it on the side okay until the filling is sealed okay let's see if i can do this without screwing it up like that <laughs> i think that's how it's oh, supposed perfect. to look yeah. yay okay yes. and pour the sweet sauce okay Ooh, that looks delicious. With peanut garnish. Crust. Peanut. Yummy. Yeah. Should we taste it? Yes. Now it's time to taste it. Where should we butcher this? Leanne? Let me start this. Okay. Bite side. Mother's first. Me first. Only because it's Mother's Day. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, this is a big one. That's what she said. Mm. <laughs> it's good? Mm -hmm. Alright, let me try it. Ah. I'm having a hard time cutting this. Alright. Let me just do it like this. Mmm. Mm. That's really good, Mom. It is. Mm -hmm. And it's veggies, right? Mm hmm. It's healthy food. It's very healthy. Yeah. I like the sweetness of the sauce is and mm -hmm. the, the vegetables. They're still al dente, so I like the crunch. The texture is awesome. Thank you, Mom. And the wrapper is soft. It is. Ooh. I want to say Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Thank you oh, for thank everything you. you do for our family. Oh, thank I you. love you. Okay, love you. Cheers. So, cheers. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Mmm. Mmm. Look good. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you for watching Ivy's Kitchen. Please don't forget to subscribe. For the complete recipe, please check out ivyskitchen.net. Until next time, happy cooking. <laughs>